What up, what up, what up, YouTube goers? Welcome to another awesome figure review on Toys Collectibles channel, figure review. Oh man, what a day today. Um, Before I start this video, I'm kind of pissed off a little, a little frustrated that the National Championships football NFL 49ers had lost to the, I believe, not the Falcons, but the Seahawks, I believe. And you know, it was kind of disappointing. Uh, I feel like Kaepernick messed up a little bit on the last play. But he was in a lot of pressure and, you know, a lot of rumors are saying he, you know, jinxed the Super Bowl last year because he defeated our under streak and, you know, he messed up now. But, you know, he's still learning. He's still kind of rookie coming out a year into two. But, you know, at the same time, it was a very good game. So, you know, it was really awesome. But at the same time, he probably learned from his mistake, but it was still a good game. So, I mean... Maybe next time for Niners fans. Maybe next time. But we're close. But whatever. But anyways, guys. Back to the video. We are starting with the NECA Aliens 2-pack battle pack. And yes, I'm proud I got these bad boys. NECA is really making a lot of great figures. I mean, there's so many figures of NECA's I want. Certain ones. And, you know, it's just like with NECA having license to the movies... You know, I feel like their figures are getting more better and better every day. But anyways, we're starting with the battle pack. Um, alien versus the red alien. So, let's start with the black alien. Now, the detailing on this black alien is really nice. It's really detailed. I really love the sculpting. I love the black texture. On this black alien I love the design that's going on his head it's really cool and then I love how his mouth is and as you can see on the side like of his um, jaws part it's really cool you can open his mouth his mouth does go all the way down but be careful um, open it all the way down because it'll pop out of his mouth so these are very sensitive mouth parts right here and I love the little piece right in his mouth the little tongue thing he has like when he kills his prey and that's really cool too bad it doesn't poke out so um yeah but anyways guys yeah like i was saying just be careful like popping this out because it's just like the what i like about this part is it's like what well, he has like the saliva coming on the side of his you know chin that's really cool and now the other detailing i love the back i love how they did the spinal cord going all the way down and you see like his little um, horn thing sticking out of his back. I, I forgot what they're called. But this I thought will like pop his tongue out but it doesn't. So this actually does pull out. But I don't want to mess with it because uh, it's pretty stuffed in pretty good. So you know I'm not trying to break it or ruin it. And then the tail part right here is really cool. It's flexible so you could actually like bend it out. Or you could bend it in. All depends how you want to display your figure. And what's good about it is it holds the um, figure very well. Like as you can see when I um, put his tail up. But on the other hand, I'm trying to close him right now. So as you guys can see, like his tail's holding his body part right there. So, you know, that's really good. It's a flexible tail. So, you know, you can do crazy poses with it. Um, he does have a waist swivel. He has a waist swivel that turns right to left. Doesn't have aft crunch. He does have elbow joints. He does have knee joints and um, feet joints. And that's really awesome too. So you could, you know, put this guy in any pose that you want him in. So, um, yeah. But let's move on to the red one. The red one is really badass. I really like how that one looks. It got like that nice brightness red reddish going on with a little black shading in that's really cool i love how that little design is and it's really awesome so same thing with the um, black alien pretty much with the red alien this is the same figure but it's painted over the black um so this is a reused figure of the black one same thing right here i love the design right there like wow that's so detailed i love the saliva i love the teeth and you can see the little tongue in his mouth really cool but it doesn't pop out that's really sucks but what really gets me irritated i took him out of the package and this little part right here popped out so i don't know if that's supposed to do that but um 
NECA got to work on some pieces that they're on doing with their figures because some pieces on this red one is very sensitive and it's really hard to put it back in and then his mouth is also sensitive so because you like I say if you guys pull it all the way out it will um, not break it but you could pop it back in but you just don't want to ruin the figure or ruining the hole like wearing it out like putting it in back and out but anyway same thing like with the tail detailing with the tail also like as you can see with the red tail it got like the nice black reddish going on so I like that also his tail does bend all the way like the black alien does so I mean same I mean same thing I mean pretty much same thing for the um, red alien he does have knee joints he has elbow joints he has a waist swivel his head does go up his head does go to the right and left but um like I was saying these figures are very sensitive comparing to the um, alien figures I'm pretty happy with NECA is doing with their figures and you know it's really badass and like I said before I love the design right there the nice black paintish going on that's really cool so as you guys can see I have my alien figures posted in an action fighting stance as you guys can see right here so these figures stand probably six and a half inches tall because if you have them standing up straight they would be tall but since you have them like this it makes them look more shorter and I actually picked up a couple so I got four aliens so you know I'm planning to get a couple more part for the collection I haven't watched all the other alien movies I only saw the first one I think the first one's better than all the other ones but I'm pretty happy I have this for my collection something new and something to try and right here I got the other alien and I got the red alien chilling right there so um one thing about this alien is um I will move this leg but the leg is really loose so you know that's kind of a bummer so you know I don't want to really mess with this figure too much or mess with the leg because it's loose when I took out the package and I feel like when I got the predator from Toys R Us exclusive his legs were loose so I don't know that's something I wonder but anyways guys my rating for these figures 10 out of 10 I hope you enjoyed the video and I hope you enjoyed the figures Please subscribe to my channel, check out my other videos, and please be part of my fan page on Facebook at Toys Collectibles Channel by pressing like and sharing with others. I'll see you guys on the next video, and peace.